Hi, and welcome to Yoga with Bex. This is Intense Forward Folds. I'm Becca, and today I'm in the Dominican Republic. Spinal safety awareness, this practice does have forward folds and twisting. Please read the description below before starting. Now grab your mat, and let's find your space. So this practice is for intense forward folding. So please make sure that you are comfortable with forward folds before doing this practice. The asanas I've included here are ones you can go very deep if you'd like. So please join me. Um, starting on the mat, we're gonna do cat cow to warm up our backs a little bit. So coming to all fours. You bring your knees underneath your hips, your wrists underneath your shoulders, make sure you're squared off. Take a deep breath in, tilt your pelvis back, arch your back and look forward. Breathe out, tilt your pelvis under, round your back, let it rise up and release your neck. Breathe in, tilt your pelvis back, arch your back, chest opening up forward. And breathe out, tuck your pelvis under, round your back and let your head hang. Continue breathing in to look forward and breathing out to release. Back rising up, breathing in, look forward and breathing out. Round your back, let it rise up. One more time, breathing in, look forward, arch your back. Tuck your pelvis under, breathe out, and let your head hang. Come back to neutral, and come up to standing. We'll start with Uttasana, a classic forward fold. So you can either have your feet together or feet hip distance apart. Get grounded, rise up tall. Take a breath. And we're going to bend forward folding. So from your hips, start to extend and fold. Coming all the way down. Now, if you can have straight legs all the way down, please do. I still need to bend my knees a little bit to protect my low back. Coming all the way down. Releasing your upper body. Let it hang. Legs are as straight as possible. And release. Breathe and let your upper body hang. Take one more deep breath here. Let's move into Padangushtasana. So first I want you to bend your knees if they're not already bent to the point that your torso is connected to your thighs. Touching, connected. And from here, we want to bring our hands under our feet. So lift up one foot from your toes up. Slide your hand under so that your big toe is right at your wrist. And then bring your foot down. Other foot, rise up just on the heel. Tuck your hand in, slide it in, and press your feet into your palms. And from here, I'm going to release your upper body, release your neck, relax, and then press your hips up, 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 straightening those legs as you're able to. But I recommend maintaining the connection between your torso and your thighs. And breathe. Keep pressing into those heels, hips rising up. Release your upper body. Neck is relaxed.
take one more deep breath here. Sing your hips up, relax, release, and then lift your feet up one at a time, release your hands. Let's come up nice and slow. Look forward, find your flat back here, find neutral spine, and take a deep breath in to come up. Beautiful. Now let's do a wide leg forward bend. So I'm gonna step out, nice wide stance, as wide as you're comfortable, feet are in parallel. Rise up tall through the spine, press firmly into your feet, especially the outsides of your feet. And breathe in, open up your chest, and breathe out to fold from your hips. Again, coming all the way down to touch the ground. From here, you're gonna bring your two first two fingers, tuck them underneath your big toe and wrap that around with your thumb. Other side, two fingers underneath your toe, wrapped around with your thumb. And take a second here, straighten your back, look forward, breathe in. Pressing into your feet and breathe out. Bend your elbows, relax, release, fold. Check that your neck is relaxed. Hips are pressing up to the sky. So breathe deeply here. You can use this hold to pull yourself down gently. Keep your shoulder blades nice and wide. Again, hips are pressing up, pressing into those feet for your hips to rise up. Gently pulling down with your arms. Release your neck, release your back. Breathe into any tense tension points. Take one more deep breath. Deepen as you breathe out. And then release your fingers out from under your toes. Look forward. And take a deep breath in. Give your breeze a little bend to rise up. Beautiful. Bring your legs back together. Take a breath. And come down to seated. So for the next asana, it's ideally done in Padmasana, seated position. If that's not accessible to you, please do maybe Ardha, half Padmasana, or a different version, something similar in a cross-legged type position, sitting up tall. Bring your arms behind your back, grab your left wrist with your right hand, and we're going to be doing some forward folds over our legs here. So relax your arms behind your back. Let them extend. Breathe in. Start twisting to your right side, looking out over your right knee, hips facing your right knee. Extend through your spine and fold forward over that knee. You will find, depending on how you are seated, one side will be easier than the other. So extending through your spine, folding forward. Come into the deepest extension that's accessible for you and breathe. Take one more deep breath and rise up, extending through your spine, 
as you come back up and back to center. Take a breath, twist to your left side from the hips, facing over your left knee, and again, rising up tall. Extend your spine as you fold out over your knee. Check that you're aligned with your knee and relax, breathe. Let your neck relax. Take one more deep breath here. And then rise up through the extension in the spine all the way up, come back to center. And now to fold forward in the center, rise up tall through your spine, start to fold from your low back, keep that extension of your spine all the way down. Fold, reach forward, 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 and then relax, release your neck. Breathe. Try to relax your entire body here. Let gravity pull you down. And breathe. Take one more deep breath. Looking forward, extend and breathe in as you rise up. Release your hands and release your legs. Beautiful. We have one more asana. Madhi Jasana. You wanna sit, you wanna sit with your legs out in front of you for this one. So I'm gonna twist to the side. Extend your legs out, pull the flesh away from under your sit bones, get really grounded. Rise up tall through your spine. And for Madhi Chasana, start with the right side. Bend your right knee, bring your right foot onto the mat, right beside your left thigh. And hug that knee in, rise up tall through your spine. You're gonna bring your right arm straight out on the inside of your knee and you want to wrap it around trying to tuck your underarm if you can around the front of your calf so wrap that arm around 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 reach back and grab a hold if you can't grab a hold grab a little towel something to to connect you and if you can grab a hold of your hands from here extend your spine look forward and Fold over your extended leg. And breathe here. You may be able to extend and fold better than I can. <laughs> and really flattening your back if you're able. Take one more deep breath here. Release your hands and come back. Un unwind, sit up tall. Release your right leg, bring your left leg in, bend that knee, foot right beside your thigh. Hug your knee in. And this time, left arm, I'm gonna come out, I'm gonna try and get my left underarm wrapping around my shin and have a hold of your hand from the other hand behind you. And from here, extend your spine and fold over your extended leg. Reaching as far forward as you can and then release, relax your neck and breathe.
Take one more deep breath. Release, unwind, sit back up. Release that leg. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this practice. This whole month has been Forward Fold. If you like this practice, please check out my other ones. I have one just to release. I have one for before bed for sleep. And if you'd like more content, please subscribe. Give me a like, thumbs up. Let me know that you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to check out my Instagram. I will see you over there. Have a beautiful day.